What's up, guys? If you are into music reaction channels that are honest, raw, and authentic, look no further. You found your destination. It is the Taz and Philly Show. Welcome to our journey. And make sure that you subscribe below and enjoy the show. <laughs> We're a reaction channel with a podcast vibe. So we notice people out there that like podcasts. We notice people out there that like reaction channels. We want to try to merge the two together. We're real and authentic, and we want you to represent music appreciation like we do. So always make sure that you like and comment on the songs that we react to, as well as go to their YouTube channel and subscribe, and maybe even a step further and purchase one of their songs. Um, also, make sure that you always check the pinned comments that we have and also our community tab because we always post stuff up there. You never know. Might be something that's beneficial to you. Please also check out our Discord. It's in the description links. Uh, we have a lot of great channels on there and it's completely free to join our Discord. So thanks so much. Hey, everybody. What is good? This is your guy, Taz or Taz and Philly. Came here to give you what you come here for. Reactions. Uh, this particular action is to an amazing Kazakhstan songstress that we've been reacting to for quite some time now. And um, more and more and more, I can't help but love her more and more. She has such an amazing voice. Um, and it pretty much teleports you to different places because she really engages the music and the song. So, because um, there's some people out there that just sing and she performs and she gives you the emotions and the journey when she sings and that's really an awesome thing so um this is a particular song that was a paypal donation request for this song called not your war and i believe it's a cover for uh i'm gonna say okeen elsie um but anyway it's a cover song not your war so this paypal donation shout out goes to david stiller so david stiller Thank you so much. Thank you very, very much for another PayPal donation. It's very, very appreciated. Um, and again, it, this all gives us opportunity as well to hear music that's new to us. Um, there's so much music that this channel has never heard before. Um, and it's really, really great. Like I used to live basically in a box and <laughs> have like the same one or two playlists that I would listen to over and over again. And here and there, I would add a song to it and stuff, but I was content with that. But since this channel started, um, there's so much new music, new to me, that um, it's really, really amazing. Um, so, yeah, so this is um, this is live. I have not heard it yet because we always like to be fully surprised um, so we don't pre-watch anything. Uh, so I hope you enjoy. We also represent music appreciation, so please make sure that you support these artists. Um, as you see here, let me hit subscribe. I know I hit subscribe before. She must have, I'm assuming, more than one YouTube channel. Uh, oh, this says this is her fan club. Okay, so I'm subscribing to that. But I know her personal YouTube channel I already has subscribed to. And I'm also hitting like, as you see here. So we practice what we preach. Please, please, please support these musicians, support these artists. Imagine if it was you, wouldn't you like to wake up the next day and say, oh, wow, somebody liked and commented and subscribed to me. It's very easy to do and it's free. So please do that. Take care of your musicians first. Take care of us second. So please smash those notifications on us and subscribe, like, and comment, please. And also, if you're willing to go that step further, share us to the other social media um, avenues to let us out there. Um, and for the artists, if you can, a step further, buy their music on like Spotify or whatever vehicle they might have it on. Um, and yeah, and always check out our community tab. We always have some stuff there, a contest or some uplifting motivational things or polls because we want to get your viewpoints or we want to know a little bit about you because you know a lot about us, but we'd like to know about you too. So um, you're more than just a view. You're a human being on the other side that matters and we really appreciate you so thanks so much for that all right let me shut the hell up let's hear what this song is all about and i'll commentate afterwards here we go Знаешь, 
Голос дети Украина Байкал на Турнише Маусу Мунженга Паза. Ерекши Дарнда Казамаз. Данеля Тулешева. Спасибо большое. Wow, that was so beautiful. Um, I looked it up because um, normally I don't look up because I like to be completely not knowing. But when it had the name um, war in it, I wanted to see what it was about. So it's about war, um, talking about the Ukraine and stuff. So nothing's good when you have to talk about war. Um, but and then it said on there, I think, the voice of peace um, on the actual concert it showed their uh yes voice of peace so first of all let me just say because this is my first time actually hearing her um sing in another language besides english which was beautiful once upon a time i didn't necessarily like uh, when i didn't know what they were saying but then someone had told me once in the comments um hopefully they'll be watching this i don't remember their name um that, you know, consider a voice as just another tool, another musical instrument. And I was like, oh, I never thought of it that way. So that's made it more helpful because even though I didn't know what she was saying, what I knew the song was about, I can still relate to the emotion and still tap into that. So she sang it beautifully. Like she sang it like in a song that's talking about war and have peace and like the travesties that you have to go through and like wondering, like what's your mindset on on going through this um, and then hoping for peace. So you can hear it in her voice. Like it was, it was, it was like uplifting and motivational. And it, and it was almost like, it was almost like a, a voice, like a guy, like, it'll be okay. We'll get through this together. That's the feeling that I got. Like, so she's singing that in song. Um, and it was just wonderful just to have a, a, a tribute and to, to, to give support. Uh, Cause that's beautiful in itself. It lets a person know people know that you're not alone um i also took the liberty of bringing up i hope this is the right one i, I brought up i think some of the lyrics um and like one part says here battle at dawn sun at sun and smoke few know how it will end what will be in the young minds tomorrow someone will have hope someone fear that's pretty damn deep of a paragraph but that is as honest as it can be because we all have different thoughts we all wonder what will be and you know there's some people that are more optimistic so those are the people that some will have hope and there's some people that are more and i don't want to say in this case pessimistic because rightfully so if you have fear that's understandable we'll just say that you just don't know so you really don't want to commit to what could be. Um, so this is a little bit different. So I won't say that. So I'll say you have people that are like really, really optimistic. We're having hope. We're having hope. And there's people that don't want to say that yet. They're really like in limbo land, not really sure. And they could just blatantly have fear. And that's totally understandable. Um, so it's crazy. I mean, it's, it's different types of atrocities that have happened all over the world. Um you know, and some some was fearful that I was even a part of. Like, you know, at the time when there was the war is going on and and COVID had started and everything, and there were, there was a few like uh people breaking in stores not too far from where I live and stuff like that, like ransacking stores and and setting things on fire. So, just seeing that like on the news and hearing about it, like that was a sense of fear. Like, damn, you know, wow. Like you hear about it on the news in some far off land, but then when you hear it and it's like several blocks down the street gives you a different mindset. So I think it's perfectly normal if people have either or emotion. Um, but it's good to have like a guide and like someone that relates to you that says, okay, we'll get through this together. It's not just you. So that's beautiful. So I love how she did this tribute. Um, and it was sang beautifully. She had a beautiful, elegant dress on. The lights were set in a certain mood, you know, because this is definitely not some party song. So, you know, there wasn't like bright lights and dancing and smiling. So her facial expressions tapped into the truth of the song. Her voice tapped into the truth of the song. 
her lyrics tapped into the truth of the song. Um, I really, really thought it was beautiful. Um, and, you know, of course, we would hope that there would never be any wars again anywhere on Earth. Uh, but that's just a tall tale. But um, one can always hope. You know, wouldn't it be great if it was peace everywhere? Wow, imagine that. In any event, let us know your thoughts. Let us know your interpretation of this song. Let us know if you heard it for the first time. Let us know if it moved you in some way. Can you relate to some way? Um, let us know if you want to get things off your chest. Like if you know somebody that was part of this um, travesty. Um, so, yeah. So um, we'll always let us know your thoughts because uh, that's what we're here for. We're not just music reactors. We also give a damn about people so if you want to get things off of your chest as i like to say it get it out into the atmosphere you can write it in a comment and so forth um you also can go to our discord channel which we have a links are in the description it's free to join we do have a dedicated section if you ever want to go in there and get some ish as i like to call it aka shit off your chest sometimes it really helps therapeutic wise to just type it out so now it's out there and um so, yeah. All right. Well, this comes to the part of our show. We always do our thumbs up pass if we like it. Thumbs down ass if we don't. Come on now. The way I was talking, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. So thank you so much again um, for this amazing, amazing request. And um, I'm sorry. I have a bad memory sometimes. So I'm seeing. I forgot the name of the David Stiller. I didn't want to disrespect and say your name incorrect. So um, thank you, David Stiller, for another donation to this song. Thanks you for choosing this song because it was really, really beautiful. And hopefully other people are going to hear it for the first time. Like I heard it for the first time. So. Um, all right. This is Taz with Taz and Philly. And I want you to take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>